The rock star Shannon B. Dorr wants the joint parenting of their children with David B. Dorr. Shannon B. Dorr wants his children to have their father in their lives. Hannah B. Dorr is doing everything possible to be co-parents of her husband, David B. Dorr. The Real Housewives of Orange County, June 14, 2009 Real Housewives of Orange County has confirmed that their past problems are now in an excellent position as they move forward in their lives. I am surrounded by people and incredible opportunities, I am very grateful, she said. Shannon and David called Shannon and David as children of the Royal Housewives of Orange County, Sophie 16 years old and 13 year old twin Stella and Adeline. While Shannon and David are not exactly friends at this time, they say they are pushing through the animosity they have faced and began to focus on their children. We are connecting, he explained. We're getting over it. We are doing the best we can. There are many animosities and I hope that, when everything is fixed, we can reach a good place of joint parenting. I want David to share the lives of my children, he continued. The children are really adjusting quite well, we are trying to find a good structure. In March, after a series of court hearings regarding his separation, a source claimed David threw bad words at Shannon Post Judge granted him joint legal and physical custody of his three children and $22,500 per month in children and the spouse. A short time later, a series of text messages sent to Shannon by her husband were reportedly leaked online. Your F disgust me. F you. What do you have to do? Eat? Because you cannot get fat, he reportedly wrote to you. After David Bedor's text message was leaked, Shannon Bedor published a statement. As David and I continue our divorce process, I am doing everything I can to move things so that we are not subject to unnecessary stress during an already difficult time, he said. I want to be as fair as possible. I will focus on a clean resolution and I will not be interested in participating in a war of words.